Kyle, obviously everyone's been talking about this uh, Malaysian Airlines flight that's disappeared. And yeah, vanished. Everyone seems to have a theory on what's happened. And uh, we wanted to run through all of the possible conspiracy theories, but we needed... Because everyone's got them. Wherever you go, you know, I just went to the 7-Eleven the other guy, and the sky the server was like, what do you think happened to that plane? Yeah, everyone talks about it. I was like, oh, it. I don't know. It, two you, Kit Kat sinks. You listen over the weekend on everyone's conversation. Yeah. It's all every, it's, everyone's talking about. It's all the time. And we don't know anything over here at KISS, so we thought we'd go straight over to our friends at the ABC yeah, who are paid to... nothing but have all the knowledge. <laughs> we thought, who's the smartest man we know? Well, Julian Morrow joins us right now, and we figured he was the best person to run it through Julian. for us. Uh, G'day, guys. Yeah, I've got to have, say... Have the smart people been talking about this or just oh, us dogs? We talk about nothing else over here at the ABC. I've got to say, though, uh, talking about an air crash with Kyle and someone from The Chaser, this is really going to go well, <laughs> isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> um, Julian, run us through some of the, uh, the, the theories that are out there. Okay, well, look, I'm not I'm not saying she's solely responsible, but remember Lara Bingle? Oh. I, mean, <laughs> yeah. I know she normally does train wrecks or car crashes, but I think this could be a new twist by Tourism Australia. It's part of the Where the Bloody Hell Are You campaign. Oh, They're trying to encourage no, people no. not to go overseas. We're off and running, okay. <laughs> okay. If you've got, uh, yeah, look, if you have been affected by this story or have any shreds of human decency, maybe take a couple of minutes uh, blocking your ears. Now, what about Oprah Winfrey? I think she could be responsible. Remember she did that campaign for Qantas? Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. So this is a this is a joke segment. I was, I was getting I ready for. Was, I had all my real. I had all my I serious all my facts oh here. No. Oh, I didn't sorry, have any sorry. jokes written down. I thought Damn. it's way too soon. Oh, okay. We don't even know all where right. where this plane is. Hang on, hang on. I can get someone from Four Corners down the road. I'll get them to come up and give you the full. Oh, thing. We didn't go to the. We didn't go to the. We should have gone to the Four oh, Corners. Yeah. Okay. Known. What about it's it's a Coles campaign. It's all part of the new Down Down promotion, and they're trying to uh, encourage people to check in with Coles. No. Okay. Frequent oh, flyer program. All these what about things that? are terrible. Go there. These are all terrible oh, jokes. No. Oh dear. Okay. Uh, the makers of Air Crash Investigation, perhaps. No, no. run out of episodes. Oh, oh, dear. I, want, right. I wanted a, a witty, intelligent discussion. That's why we got you for, oh, for look, what really like could proper, have happened. The proper things that could have happened. You should have got me ten years ago. Um, um, look, maybe it, I think that guy that you met at Seven Eleven, Kyle. Maybe that was Elvis, and maybe maybe it's all part of it. It's the only thing that's big enough to keep Elvis in it these days. No. <laughs> All right. Okay, look, here you go. I've got one then. I've got one. Okay, it's disappeared without a, tr a trace. Maybe it's at Today FM. Oh, oh okay, Julian, Julian. What's going on? Wait, wait. What do you think really happened, Julian? Well, I think really happened. I think it's probably in North Korea. Do you? Yeah. No. Yeah. I reckon it's been hijacked, and I think it's been taken to North Korea. <laughs> I, think, no? I, think, I, think, I think that was serious. <laughs> But I, th I think it might be hijacked as well. Yeah. Well, it's got to be hijacked. Well, they said, I think they even said it's been hijacked. <laughs> Either that or, or the pilot seriously failed uh, flight school. It's got, I mean, there's no way it could be anywhere else. What, what else could it, maybe it's at the ABC. No one watches it there. Maybe it's just that maybe that's why. You're still um, at the ABC yourself, though. Yeah, you would have yeah. seen it if it was there. Well, I've been uh, the, the, practically without a trace and the ABC ratings wise are exactly the same thing. Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm, 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 I'm totally unprepared for this segment because so I. I just had like how many people were on board, where it was last seen. <laughs> yeah, well, that's what I had. I yeah. Well, the points down here talking about I've the clearly weather. got the wrong brief. I apologise, oh, guys. Some... I, I... Okay, well, who briefed you? Let's find <laughs> Let's out get them on and they can carry them. over the segment. <laughs> hey, uh, Bondi Hipster, why don't you come in here? Yep, get what them happened? on. Come in. What yeah. happened, Simon? <laughs> I know, oh, no, he's coming in. Hang on, I don't on. think Julian was brief that we were after a serious segment. I think he thought we were we were hoping I'm for. I'm so a... sorry. No, well, no. Is, well, I thought you were doing an opening number at the Logies for a second. <laughs> you take a seat over there, mate. Something about dying badly. Oh dear. Okay, Simon. There you go. You've what's got the air. What's happened? To the hipster. That, you're on with the hipster, mate. Well, the oh, moment great. when you get your hands in your head. That was. Yeah. Look, I think what's happened is the producers have said. Um, oh, he's, he's blaming another producer. Let's bring the one in that's the responsible. <laughs> no, no, no. I think what's happened is oh, that right. Julie Jeez. was supposed to take it. We thought by funny he meant he was going to take his, not take it that way. But this. Well, yeah. like, there was a few people laughing out there. I noticed some people laughing. So, like, he he, he was funny. That's a first for me. But oh, that's uh, good. maybe I'll a, take that. maybe it's a bit soon. But that's what the chaser do. See, they go. People go. Oh no, no, no! That's not too soon for that. And they go. No, no. Let's dress up as a terrorist and walk <laughs> beside the car. It'll be hilarious. People, when it was funny. But, um, I could read other news headlines. Would that help? Well, we got our news girl here. See there. 
Actually, oh, she's no, not she, here. She's vacated the seat. <laughs> so when this goes on a current affair tonight, she's nowhere to be seen. God, she's smart. Actually, I'm going to go and see how she's doing. Uh, I don't abandon ship. Okay, well, so, uh, Julian, you're... <laughs> oh, God. Okay, so... Jackie, I'm going come... up on the roof for a ciggy. I'll let you and Julian... No, but Julian, it it's seriously... I've been involved in enough... Over the years, I don't need to start at a new joint. What we will do, though, is on thirty. What we wanted to do, Julian. My apologies, you weren't briefed. What we wanted to do was take calls on a snap poll thirteen one zero six five. What people actually think happened to the plane, though. I mean, sorry for the confusion. <laughs> we love you, though, Julian. And, sure. Uh, you, okay. You can go to your website, giantdwarf.com. Hey, someone just said, sorry, I've just come back. Someone just said in the newsroom, this is more awkward than Alty and Childs on with Ronan Keating yesterday. <laughs> yeah, definitely.